Falcons in this one wearing number three in the gray uniforms. It's a turnover on Air Force. Brock Miller ne nearly gave it back on the travel. The touch pass inside, and Kata with the slam off the assist from Justin B. You saw Mimi Kata able to catch the basketball and finish with that strength. That's why he's an NBA prospect. And one, Ryan Swan, the second foul on Mimi Kata. Question is, which bench squad is going to step up? Both of these teams with two on the shot clock now. A.J. Walker heaving the three. <laughs> it goes in. We're not doing anything to allow Utah State to beat us. We're beating ourselves with turnovers. And missed threes, at least up until that Sid Tomes triple. The other way, the reverse layup not there for Chris Joyce. Loose ball. Oh. Joyce tracks it down. Oh, oh, love that hustle. Now Joyce for three. How about it? Oh, here it is right here. Look at the hustle. Falling out of bounds. Walker to Joyce. Wide open. Three-point shot. Nothing but net. This time it's Scotty inside. Kata pops it out, but right to Sid Tones. And Air Force has the lead for the first time since the opening minute of this ball game. Lavelle Scotty misses this. Watch Ryan Swan, just to the right, gets a piece of it. Oh no, you know what, he fought for it. Kata knocked it out to Sid Tomes, and that's the best shot in basketball. After a rebound, a kick out three point shot. Force run, Swan's got six of those nine. Swan again, this time from three, you bet. To back threes for Utah State. As Ben Solon flies high. I love this move. The big fella, Keaton Van Solen, all six, seven of them, not even 200 pounds, lying on his feet and slams it home down the lane. Air Force has made five of their last nine from three after starting the game two of 13. Merrill went down hard and won on the offensive glass. Get up, he's got a pretty good voice. <laughs> Doing some John Lennon covers on his YouTube channel. And one, Ryan Swan flexing, and he's got a season high 26. A team that was nationally ranked earlier in the year, and they've run into their problems as of late, and they're handling them. One on one, Swan gets the best of Kata. See what their potential is. They hang with the number seven team in the country, and then they follow it up here on the road against Air Force. And all credit to Air Force for their performance in this game. These kids have been up since 6 a.m., first day <laughs> of classes. It's a late game. It's 11 o'clock here at Mountain Time, and they're still going at it strong. Largest defeat of the season for Utah State. They lose by 19 on the road to the Air Force Valley.